Let's talk about six makeup tips that make you look unrecognizable. Number one is a good eyelash curler. I walked into Sephora and asked them for the eyelash curler that everyone's been talking about. And they knew exactly what I was talking about. The Ride or Die for the e.l.f. one, I think it's really good. But this one, insane. It's like touching my eyebrow. I feel like it truly affects the way you look. It was like 20 or so dollars, which is normally a lot. But it's the Shiseido brand. Number two is to apply cream highlight underneath your base. I don't do this all the time, but I definitely do it if I want a little extra glow underneath my skin. This iconic London one is like absolutely insane. Specifically, is their illuminator. Use my finger. I'm blending that into my cheek bone eyebrow bone and just kind of like all over so if you want that unrecognizable glow look it's one of my favorite little hacks number three is the way you style your eyebrows so many people recently have been coming for me for my eyebrows i think i do them okay it was just like the past few videos i filmed it all in one day so my eyebrows were looking a little raggedy i was also so hungover on that so i don't i, don't, I couldn't even see straight love it because you guys are giving me so many tips we're gonna do a little straight out look i think that is good i don't know you let me know okay eyebrows are done let me know what you think number four is actually lip tint on your cheeks i saw a tip recently on my for you page that people can use it on their cheeks this way your blush and your cheeks always look red i'm like why did i not think about this sooner um take it off but oh my god it leaves like the perfect little pigment wait i'm obsessed with the way this turned out a little bit more highlight on top number five is to switch up your normal routine for example i'm normally like a big lash black eyeliner makeup look i normally do the full like nine yards but I find that when I switch it up and do more of like a naturalish look, I seem to look a little bit more unrecognizable because it's not something I normally do. And I just got to London. We've been adjusting to the time zone. We've been like sleeping like crazy. It's been so fun. We're just having our like little European summer. Did a little glute pump earlier, getting our booties all juicy for when we get to France. Lastly, number six is to set with a pink eyeshadow. I know that sounds crazy, but it has to be like a very light pink like this to the point where it's almost white. My friend Caroline actually discovered that like this dense brush uh, pat underneath my eye it brightens it so much. It looks so and because it's eyeshadow, you can like play around and put on your lids as well. Also, we literally just hit 600K as I was traveling here. And normally I always do like a little giveaway when we hit these milestones, but I'm abroad. I can't ship anything. So keep that in mind. As soon as I get back to the US, I'm going to do a huge giveaway. Stay tuned for that. I literally love you guys so much. I love this new chapter of like the whole makeup sister energy because I just feel it reciprocated on both sides. But anyway, I post these every single day. So don't forget to follow and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next one. We're adding some freckles so you can see the final look. All right. And that's a wrap. Bye.